What's up everybody? Uncle Mike here. I am sorry I haven't made any videos lately. I have just been swamped at work. Um, I kind of took on another new position at work where I'm in charge of all the superintendents, all the jobs. It's kind of like a general superintendent position, whatever they want to call it. So I've been really busy trying to get settled into that new position. But as y'all know, a couple weeks ago, we went to Orlando. They claimed they were gonna have a 484, junior 484 shootout. I went over there to test on Friday with Corey and Justin and the car, the car is really coming around. I found the couple issues that we were having with the nitrous. I got them fixed. Uh, now it's just a matter of optimizing the engine. Now we still, uh, we're still running it very, very safe but it's, it's still running a decent number, so I'm pretty happy with that. Uh, Corey's got a great handle on, on the whole tune-up part of it. I don't even question it. I just get in it and drive. Um, and I know that he's not gonna try and burn my stuff up. He, and I know that if it, it does happen, we burn something up, it's probably because I said step it up a little bit or whatever. Um, but we're doing a great job with that. We went to the, we ended up uh, Calypso, Tyler Gregan drives Calypso. He come over and we were sitting there Saturday. We didn't know what was going on. There was only a couple cars there, excuse me. And, uh, you know, they wanted to run for five or a thousand dollars because we didn't think they were even going to have the race. And uh, I said, yeah, you know, we're going to make make a test hit and then we'll we'll talk to you after that. So a little while later, we go out, make it. Uh, well, we were fixing to go make a test hit and smoke come uh they sent word over, hey, the driver of the meeting. And we was, I was kind of surprised because, like I said, there was only a couple cars there. There was more cars there, but they were just there testing. And uh, Smoke said he was going to put the money up, even if it was two cars. So I said, well, hell, run them for 500 and or and lose 500 or, or, or win 500 or go ahead and enter the shootout one pass for three grand. So that was kind of a no brainer. We went ahead and signed up and long story short, Tyler and them made a, uh, a hit in a Calypso and it kicked the tires. We went up, we made a hit and kicked the tires. Just too hot in the middle of the day to try and put any power down. So Corey said, don't worry about it. I trusted his judgment and I got the car ready. We were in the lanes at nine and uh, I got out on him. I treat him on the tree a little bit. Um, he run right up beside me though. Um, but man, when that thing shifted into high gear, it was like we were side by side and then it just, pulled away from him. I probably would
about a half a car maybe um, but it was you could feel that uh, Corey had carried the launch curve out a little bit further just to make sure we could get off the starting line and it worked and we got the win got three thousand bucks I was I know I put a few posts up about it and stuff but I kind of just been sitting quiet this race we got coming up in Georgia's a big deal to me um, it's the, the 27th, 28th of this month, and I really want redemption. So I got the car unloaded today. I'm gonna service the engine, uh, go through and check all the valves, drop the tranny fluid, put new fluid in the tranny. Just, just make sure that everything is where it should be and everything's new and clean and uh, ready to go. The car uh, is doing everything on the computer. Whatever Corey's been telling it to do, we can go back and look at the data and it's, it's, it's doing exactly what we're asking it to do. So I feel that the car is as good as, it, as, as it's ever been, knock on wood. Uh, as far as running and everything. So, it's gonna kinda suck that I'm gonna be up in Georgia by myself, but I, I will be emailing files to Corey and he'll be tuning it over the internet. Um, man, they, they are kicking ass. All them guys involved in that program over there. Corey and Justin, Travis Harvey, Lee helped on the, you know, man, them guys took that money and that was pretty something amazing. And then they come out this weekend and dominate at uh, MPK. So I'm pretty proud of my, my buddies. Now I just got to keep my little streak that I got started. Hopefully I can carry some momentum into Georgia and uh, get, a, get, get us back in the finals and, and get a shot to win, win the money. But I don't know what you guys use for filters and stuff, but I use Wix racing filters. I've always kind of run Castrol motor oil in all my race cars I've ever had. I actually um, use a high zinc content castor oil. Uh, I use Valvoline uh, full synthetic in my transmissions. I run VP Racing Fuel uh, C23. So we're going to get this thing tuned up get her all ready to go and hopefully hopefully we can go go flex some muscle man I, I really would love to do that I've always kind of been a a class filler and all the stuff I try to do and uh, I feel right now that my car is capable to beat any car out there I know there's some that are faster than me but if I get up on the wheel and do my job and and cut a good tree and and just get out front, they'll be hard to catch me. So I don't really have a whole lot going on today. Um, I want to just get the car out of the trailer, get it in here in the shop. I'm probably going to come over this week and uh, do a service on it, go through all the valves and just check everything over or once over. Um, and then get ready to load it up this weekend because next week uh, Wednesday or Thursday morning I'm pulling out of here early because I'm going to test Thursday and Friday I got a couple things that I want to try and see because I mean them guys are going to be them guys all them junior 484 guys there's been a lot of chit chat on our on our web page and 
I just sit there and be quiet because I'm not good at the grudge racing stuff, the game and the talk and the lingo, but I'll just, I'll let my car speak for itself. I think, I think we got a good car. Um, I'm probably going to throw some new tires on it. It's, it hasn't had a new set of tires in a while. Um, and we'll just see where we go from there. Like I said, I apologize for slowing down on the videos. I'm gonna try and get some good videos while we're up in Georgia in a week or so and and put out some more content. It's just, I, I don't have much help. I appreciate the guys that do help me, Jimmy and Slinky. Uh, Andrew's been coming when he can. I got my buddy Wally. And uh, it's like when one of them is, I, don't, I usually have at least one of them guys helping me and uh, they're a big help because I'm old and I get lazy quick and I don't want to do shit. I'm just be honest. But I'm trying to I'm trying to get it worked out where where we can get some good things happening for us moving forward. Uh, I just gotta I gotta keep getting after it. It was hard to get motivated today because, man, I've been putting a lot of hours in at work during the week, and I just don't want to do anything. So I appreciate you. I I can't thank y'all enough for sticking with me. I know I'm been crapping it out, but I'll get it. I'll get better at it. Um, once once I get my new position at work under control, y'all don't give up on me. It's not like I'm making a ton of money anyway. I haven't been putting out much videos or anything, so, but I need to start doing better at that because that three or 400 bucks here or there helps with fuel and everything else. So I appreciate you guys. Remember to share, like, follow, subscribe, and hope y'all have the rest of a great day. Uncle Mike out.